Here's your WNEM TV5 news update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Blake Keller. Let's take a look at the top stories we're following. Flint police need your help to find a missing woman right here on your screen. 42 year old Karen Hemphill was last seen October 11th at her home on East Sherman Avenue. She was in a black and gray outfit with sweatpants. And if you know where she could be, please call Flint police. State is making contraception more accessible to families through the Take Control of Your Birth Control program, providing over-the-counter birth control pills and emergency contraception for free. And the director of women's care at Great Lakes Bay Health Centers in Saginaw says they've already gotten their first shipment and will give it out until it runs out. You can get more information on the free contraceptives through our hot link section. And a reminder to watch out for deer on the road to Scola County Sheriff's Office posting this map. The blue dots represent the number of car deer crashes it's investigated this year. The yellow and orange dot represents people injured in those crashes. The Insurance Alliance of Michigan and Michigan United Conservation Club says just this month, Michigan's averaging more than 360 car deer crashes a day. We have meteorologist Matthew Manjo here with your first alert forecast. Thank you, Blake. For the remainder of this Thursday, we'll just have more rain moving through mid-Michigan. So definitely quite a soggy day is going to be ahead of us here. As we head into tonight, we will see most of this rain coming to an end. But for today, uh, you'll really just want to have that rain gear ready to go. Uh, the afternoon showers could have a little bit more broken coverage compared to this morning. But again, really not until tonight where most of this rain does come to an end. We still just could have a lingering shower early tomorrow or a little bit of drizzle. So we do want to give our hunters the first alert to that, but up to about a half of an inch of rain is expected for today. So at the very least, this rain still bringing down the fire danger again for a little while. And with the rain and all the cloud coverage today, temps stay pretty level, only up to about 46. Temperatures barely moving from where we're starting off this morning too. We'll also hold on to those mid 40s tomorrow morning for opening morning. So actually quite seasonable temperature wise. Our wind also remaining light out of the north, only about five miles per hour. And again, other than that isolated shower, we're actually not in too bad of shape for opening day. The afternoon and evening hunts tomorrow. Those will definitely be dry. But 52 tomorrow afternoon, also 52 on Saturday, a few morning showers on Sunday, but eventually up to 57 Sunday afternoon. And then the middle of next week just sees more soggy weather. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 7 for the latest news, weather and information.